how to spy on other people's Facebook ads. And it used to be the case that you could do that really, really simply from their Facebook page. You used to be able to look at something on their Facebook page called Info and Ads. And uh, that was easy, but now they've changed it. And I, so I spoke to some of my friends and this is the new way of doing it. I actually spoke to Matt Duggan, who's a genius on Facebook ads. He did all the Facebook ads course that we have. He is a freaking genius. Um, so let me give you the link. Let's just start with the link. All right, let's just start there. So if you are watching the recording of this, this is a good reason to be on these calls and then you'd get the link. If you're not on a call, no worries, you don't get the link. All right, so let's suppose that um, somebody give me a product to research for them for Facebook ads. Let's just take something off the, off the top of the heads. Give me a product. Knife sharpener, says Erica. All right, let's, let's start with that. So look at all the stuff I can do. Look at all the stuff I have been doing. Old shiny teeth, I've been research researching what he's been up to. Uh, knife sharpener. I'm going to do my best to stop. Here we go. Search for knife sharp. So there's a couple of different things I can do. I can look at knife sharpeners that are for sale, which in and of itself is extremely interesting that I can do that given how much Facebook is moving into online shopping and buying things through Facebook marketplaces. But anyway, let's not even get into that. Let's look at this one instead. Wicked Edge, Wicked Wicked man, wicked edge, precision knife sharpeners. Let's see what these guys have been up to. So here's their adverts. They've got one advert that they're currently using. That looks like an advert that they would run. Let's just try opening that. I wonder if I can open it. Yeah, I can. So that looks like an advert that they would run for a Facebook ad. It's a pretty good uh, Facebook ad for an Amazon listing, should I say. Pretty good advert. So if I was selling knife sharpeners, I'm not, but if I was, I could come to this Facebook page I've just given you and research what other people in other marketplaces are doing and then get ideas for my own thing, if that makes sense. Nudge, nudge, wink, wink. Uh, dog shampoo says William Diplock. Let's have a look at that. So, dum, 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 dum. Uh, dog shampoo. Did that work? Come on, Asher, get your shit together, mate. Doggy shampoo. There we go. Look at that. Even gives me a drop down menu. Now, ah, interesting. Interesting drop down menu. You guys know I love that shit. All right, so dog shampoo, inactive and active. Ooh, that's cool. All pages. Look at that. I can, I can also look at that. That's sexy ass. Anyway, so down dog coffee roasters. Oops, well, that's not so great. Here's some doggy shampoo. Here's a doggy related video. Here's some doggy related things. Let's have a look. So if I was selling in Australia, I would go and look at the USA. I'd also be interested in, of course, looking at what's happening in the United Kingdom, because who knows what the hell they're doing there. Nothing there, no dramas. I wonder if there's anything in Australia. Austra Austria, not in Australia. Interesting, I can't see Australia. Very, very interesting. So some things there for you. Link didn't come through, Neil. Yes, it did. You just gotta go check. It's in your chat area, Chrissy. That's where it is. Uh, do you wanna do one more? No, it didn't. All right, I suck. Try this one. Dumb, how's that? Thanks, Mark. Nope, no link. Link didn't come through. All right, all right, I suck. <laughs> I just need help. I need help. Oh my goodness. How on earth have I got successful? That's just ludicrous. What the good news about that, of course, is that clearly you don't need to be smart to do this shit. Give me one more thing. I want to go and look at one more thing. All right, come on. Give me one more thing to go. Nose hair trimmer. All right, let's go look at that. I don't even know. Nose hair trimmer. There you go. Got some folks doing that sort of stuff. Page name contains nose hairs trimmer. See all ads from specific page. Let's have a look at that one. World's best. No ads for that one. Let's try going backwards. Nose hair trimmer. And then I'm going to have a look at one just for me. Okay. Oh, nothing in the UK. Thank you. Let's go and look in, in here. Mm, maybe nothing there for that one, Paul. 
Let's have a look for one in keto, because that's something I'm just doing at the minute. Search for keto. Let's just search keto. Holy shit, look at all that. Make your body great again. Clearly that's a Trump-inspired advert. Do you get the idea? I mean, there's just... Oh, Sonia, I am not even going to look at that, you bloody bastard, making me try and look for that. I'll go all red and, and horribly embarrassed if I look for that, Sonia. Uh, I'll let you do that in your own space. Anyway, you get the idea. You can see how this works. And then, of course, what you do... Nudge, nudge, wink, wink. Go look in America. See what's happening in America. And then model ideas into the Australian marketplace. Or go look in the UK, what's happening in the UK, then model ideas into the USA, for instance. All right, makey sensey. Now, there is a whole nother level of shit to this, but I need to go and figure it out because um, Matt only shared this with me yesterday, Arvo. Uh, but there's a whole new level to this as well. But I'm going to go figure it out. It's a different page, what's called the API. I'm gonna go figure it out and then I'll share that with you, okay? Hey, thanks so much for watching that video and I hope that you got some massive value from it. Before you go, do you live in Australia? If you do, this is for you. Would you like to learn how to sell things on Amazon here in Australia? Would you like to know what sells really, really well and what sells for the maximum amount of profit? Would you like to know where you can source those products from, whether that be in China or here in Australia and how to source them so you pay bottom, bottom dollar and get maximum value for what you're doing. If you do, please subscribe to my channel and like this video and you'll learn that and much, much more. It's the exact same information that people like Jeff from New South Wales I've used to make $45,000 a month on Amazon that Sue, who's from the sunny coast, has used to purchase herself a brand spankly BMW every single year as a result of her e-commerce business. And the lovely Kate from Barrel in New South Wales has used to make $32,000 a year on, uh, sorry, a month, not a year, a month on Amazon. And indeed, Anthony, who makes $15,000 a month on Amazon, selling, as he puts it, odds and sods. If you'd like to learn the exact same inf information that they use to maximize their profits for their Amazon businesses, subscribe to this video, like my channel, and post below if you want me to teach you something. Okay, I'm out of here. Speak to you soon. Bye. Subscribe. Subscribe. Do it now.